What's up, Launch Brad Nation? Casey Bloyer here along with our founder, David Levesque. Uh, hey, thanks everybody who came out for the uh, brunch. We had a great time and uh, thank you to Off Broadway Cafe and uh, the Colorado Meat Pie Company. We had a great Sunday, absolute blast to everybody in here. So thanks so much and thanks everybody for being uh, cordial and allowing the distancing and spacing out. Everybody was great, so thank you so much. We really, yeah. really had a great time. So don't forget, a lot of new stuff out. Uh, German chocolate cake is on uh, that was uh, released yesterday along with Point Nemo, Strawberry Key Lime Goza. That's and great beer. Great. Our collab with uh, Flight Co. Brewing, uh, Winged Orbiter, which is a West Coast IPA. Uh, so a lot of beers came on yesterday, so a lot of changes. If you haven't had them, come on in. Uh, got a list of food trucks all this week. You'll see that on this post. So uh, every day is packed full. Uh, a lot of stuff coming up as well. Um, brewing this week, Paul uh, is doing a, yet another batch of piggyback because uh, it kind of goes fast around these places, just <laughs> yep. a little bit. So, yeah, that beer's been flying. It's so, been yeah. fantastic. So, and the return of a beer this week, we don't know, we gotta have some beers kick real quick, but the return of the original Trinity. Yep, yeah, so original Trinity's coming back, a uh, non-barrel age version. So we'll have that back on this week, hopefully. Uh, you know, a couple beers need to kick, so we'll get everybody in early this week drink beers and uh, we'll be able to have that on hopefully by the weekend, so. Absolutely, and that's one of the OGs of Launchpad. It's one of the original beers from uh, yeah, when yeah, you back first when I was opened. Brewing in my garage. So. Yep. yep, so there we go, that'll be out. Uh, a lot of other beers, some form of honey beer. I asked Paul, what's he brewing this week? He said, some form of honey beer. Yeah. All right, so uh, who knows? Maybe uh, Citron will come back, maybe uh, Kuroshi, who knows? But uh, some form of that. Uh, we have other beers coming out. Uh, I had my chance to brew my first beer with Paul as a Vienna Lager. Yeah. So that'll be down. Uh, that, that's ways out because it's going to take a little bit. So, Couple But we months. got some uh, big news coming up. Uh, GABF will be uh, virtually this year. So we're going to do the award ceremony on October 16th, which is a Friday. But leading up to that week, we've collabed with a bunch of breweries for yeah. a special release. So yeah, we've been kind of hitting at it lately, uh, virtual GABF tasting. So what it is, is you're gonna be able to come into the brewery, you're gonna buy four eight ounce cans. They're gonna be our GABF beers. So on the label, it's gonna say what beer it is, what style it is, what category it's in. So on the idea is on the 16th, while you're watching the event, you can pull the beer and you can say, oh, it's in category 14, let's see if it wins. It's in category 20, let's see if it wins. Now we did collab with Bent Barley Brewing, Downhill Brewing, Comrade Brewing, and Coda Brewing. So we have four other breweries that are gonna be in on this. So five breweries total. So that'll give you a total of 28 ounce cans. On October 10th, they will be released. Each brewery will be releasing their own four packs, 100 of them. So it's first come, first serve, October 10th. And you'll go to that brewery, grab a four pack, run to the other brewery, grab a four pack, run to the other brewery. You can do as many breweries as you want or as little breweries as you want. On the label, there's a couple QR codes. One's for a score sheet, um, so you can kind of, if you want to score, have some fun. Um, and the other one's for like guidelines, just uh, it's PJCP guidelines, but it'll give you an idea of what you're looking for in those styles. You can also search on the internet yeah. and find out what that style is supposed to be, what characteristics. The big thing on the, uh, the label is that score sheet though. You can print those score sheets out, you can keep scores. You can have a fun little tasting event with you and your friends. Um, once again, they're eight ounce cans, a uh, four pack. And uh, October 10th, they're gonna be going on sale at every brewery. So we'll have October 10th through the 16th to pick those up, uh, first come, first serve. And then we'll be able to hopefully uh, sit around and uh, taste them and drink them and you'll get to actually try the beer that was entered into the competitions. And uh, each brewery will be doing this. And I'm, a, I'm sure we haven't confirmed, but I'm sure that every brewery also is showing the award ceremony at the brewery. Uh, Launchpad will be. We'll have the award ceremony. We'll all be here. Uh, hopefully, we have some great news. But hey, we just it's fun to be a part of this. So you guys can come out, start getting these uh, October 10th, leading up and on the 16th of the party. Uh, until then, I uh, hope to see all your smiling faces back in here. It's supposed to be a pretty good uh, week of weather, so we will have the extended patio out there. If you want to sit outside and enjoy that. And again, uh, we'll have all our food trucks listed for this week. It's going to be absolutely a great week. And hey, come on, you got to get into Launchpad today. It's National Drink of Beer Day. That's true. And we don't have. A I know beer. we don't have a beer. Guess yeah. what? Guess what we're doing after this. <laughs> Nat, so we'll be. You will have a pint. You have a pint. Everybody has a pint. So there you go. Hey, thanks so much, everybody. We appreciate the support. And hey, until the next time, raise your glass. Cheers.